Today, we will discuss the latest controversy involving two popular K-pop groups, Black Swan and Baby Monster. So keep watching. On November 27, Baby Monster released their newest song entitled Batter Up, which was then followed by the release of a da by member Fatu, a member of Black Swan, on December 8. However, what should have been a moment of joy for fans, instead turned into controversy due to allegations of plagiarism between the two songs. Some Baby Monster fans claim that Fatu's Ad Day blatantly imitates elements of Batter Up, especially since the song was released first. However, Fatu, in her clarification, she provided a detailed explanation that should open the eyes of all of us. Fatu explained that the plagiarism claim was unfounded. She stated that the producers of Ade and Batter Up used the same music samples. It's important to remember that using the same samples is legal in the music industry. Even though this controversy arose, Fatu firmly denied accusations of plagiarism, stating that she had no intention of copying Baby Monster's song. On TikTok, Fatu emphasized that she and her producer used different music samples, and it just so happened that both of their producers chose the same samples. Fatu also expressed her disappointment with the unwise comments she received and invited critics to better understand the creative process in the music industry. Interestingly, despite being involved in controversy, Fatu actually showed her support for Baby Monster by playing the song Batter Up and Dancing while listening to it on her live TikTok broadcast. Using the same music samples is not necessarily an act of plagiarism, and we should understand how complex the creative process is in the music industry, especially in the very dynamic K-pop genre. So, what do you think about this controversy? Please share your opinions in the comments and don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any interesting content from us.